Hi guys, today I'm going to be harvesting my sweet corn. I really wanted to wait for a dry day, but we haven't had one. It's looking like it could rain. I'm going to get it off the stalks as fast as I can and then take it inside, blanch it and get it into the freezer. I've had a couple already. I just twist off nice and easily. Woo. And here we go, let's unwrap it and have a look. I've been finding they've had quite a few earwigs in them, so I like to unwrap them outside. See what we've got. Oh, it's a nice looking colour. Very orange. Oh, well there's, hot, well there's some at the top that haven't been fertilised, but the rest's looking good. And this variety is called True Gold. And these are the sweet corn that I've picked. There's kind of a mix. I'm a bit worried. Some of them look like they could have gone mouldy. It's been very wet recently. And then some of them, like this one, are just really small and I don't think there's anything in there, but that's, that's usually the one that's been the second cob. There's usually one big one and then a, a skinny one like that. Okay, here's the corn. And I'm a bit disappointed. There are a few that look good four or five maybe this was that tiny one so that just hasn't been fertilized at all so just toss that into my big pile of husks this is the first one that i opened which i think is looking dried out possibly i just left it too long and then there's a kind of mix this one didn't get fertilized i can work on that i can do some hand pollination next year um, similar story with this little one but then look at this one it's like the glass corn it's it's not it's not a variety that's meant to change color so I don't know if that's bad like it like if it's gone off those ones do feel harder than the others and it also looks like this one is about to change in the same way you can kind of see some of those kernels there are just starting to get that blush to them so a bit of a bit of a mixed bag and not that many here I've definitely had better years for corn so overall I'm a bit disappointed I'll get the ones that are good into the freezer um, I'm not sure about the others let me know if you if you've seen that before with the the color changing um, I'll definitely do corn again because it's one of my favorite things previously i did an f1 variety and this time i did a heritage true gold variety so maybe it's just not so hardy or needs a bit more attention I'm not sure you win some you lose some but we're still gonna have sweet corn for tea <laughs> thanks for watching guys bye bye